Hi, boys and girls from the Lilac Room. Today we're going to be talking about patterns. Do you know that patterns are all around us? I see one on me. Look at this. It looks like black, but it's gray. There's dark gray, light gray, dark gray, light gray, dark gray, light gray. There's a pattern right there on my clothes. Look to the person, look on your clothes and see if you have any patterns. Maybe the person next sitting next to you might have a pattern in their clothes. You could look at theirs too and see if you find a pattern. Well, today we're going to be talking about and making patterns, and I'm going to do a simple one, just an AB pattern. So that's going to be using two shapes. I'm going to use be using the items in my basket that I have here. Oh, and look on my basket. There's a pattern too. See the stripes and then red and then the stripes. That's a pattern. There are patterns all around. So we're going to start a simple one, and I'm going to use two shapes. First, I'm going to start with a butterfly, and then... A star. So I've got a blue butterfly and an orange star. What do you think's next? Because it's going to be, we're going to repeat it. Did you say blue butterfly? You are right. And then what's next? Did you say an orange star? You are correct. Then what do you think is next? That's right, a blue butterfly. And then what do you think's next? Did you say an orange star? You are correct. Well, let's see. Let's do something a little bit more difficult. So we're going to do three shapes. So we're going to start off with a green turtle. Do you see the green turtle? And then a red apple. And then a yellow duck. So this is, we're going to, we're going to call this an ABC pattern because it's using three objects. And this one just an AB pattern. We're just using two objects. So I have Remember, we're going to be repeating after three objects. So I have a turtle, apple. Ah, oh, did you say turtle? You're right. And then what comes next? A red apple. Did you say red apple? And what's next? A yellow. Did you say yellow duck? You are right. So we are repeating after three objects. Then what's next? Did you say a green turtle? You're right. And then what's next? A yellow duck? No, not a yellow duck. What's next? A red apple. And then what's next? A yellow duck there. I was a little confused and sometimes that's okay. So you have a green turtle, red apple, yellow duck, green turtle, Red apple, yellow duck, green turtle, red apple, yellow duck. That's a simple ABC pattern using three shapes. And this one is using how many? Two shapes. If you said two shapes, you are right. Well, I'm going to show you a book about patterns out in the world. And there's going to be some spots and stripes and patches and a swirl. This was put out by Parenting Magazine. There's really not an author, but somebody probably took these really cool pictures in here. Stripes. A zebra has stripes. Can you see the stripes on this zebra? Can you see what colors they are? Did you say black and white? You are right. Patches. A giraffe has patches. Do you see the colors in the patches? Did you see what color those were? I would say that that is white with some brown. <gasps> spots. <gasps> A ladybug has spots. What color are there, her spots? Did you say black and red? You're correct. All these spots. Looks like a pattern. <gasps> stripes. This fish has stripes. Let's see. See it? Orange and white and orange and white and orange and white and orange. And there's a little bit of black all around it, too. Patches. This cow has patches. Do you see the patches around it? And that looks like also a nice pattern right there. Black and white. <gasps> spots. This frog has spots. Do you see the spots? What color are those? Did you say blue and black? You're right. 
stripes. Oh, this tiger has stripes. A lot of white, but you could still see. What color are these? Orange, orange and black, and orange and black. Kind of an orangish brownish color. Tigers are cool. Patches. Oh, look at the beautiful monarch butterfly. This butterfly has patches. But I could also see some patterns here with all these spots and, and uh, good little patches all around. Can you see the pattern in that butterfly? Spots. This cheetah has lots of spots and I could see a pattern in there too. Let's see. We have one more page left in here. Where is it? A spiral. Yeah, you could kind of see a pattern in, in that uh, snail. That snail has a spiral. Look at, I have earrings on and I have a spiral in my earrings too. Just like this little snail. Let's see. One last page. Patterns. So there are different ways to look at patterns. There's stripes, there's patches, and there's spots, and there's a spiral. Those are patch those are patterns, my friends. Alright, stay safe. Until next time. Bye bye, Lilac Room friends.